Hi everyone, I'm Glenn. Welcome to All Bricks Reviews, where you always find the biggest range of reviews of LEGO and other LEGO style sets. Today's review is a Crawler Crane set 42042. So keep watching to the end guys, this crane is a beauty. Let's go through all the things that it can do and a few of the mods which I did to it. First thing you'll notice, you might have noticed in the intro, the power functions control box is gone. We have the control plus hub instead, which is Bluetooth to a phone, rather than just have a switch on and off and then operate forward reverse for each of the functions. By having the uh, the app, you can you can reverse the direction automatically there, not just go stop. And you also get proportional speed as well with the with the app control, so you can go faster and slower, not just on off. You have a powered track system. So that's why it's a crawler crane. It will actually move itself. The other thing it will do, the turntable turns around. You can do that as well. And then there's the claws. So you can pick up and move things around like a crane would do. As I mentioned, by having app control, it's very simple, just one sliding button. You can go forwards and reverse. You don't need to, once you've engaged, you can engage either direction. You don't need to change whichever setting. You can just use it on here, go forwards, reverse, whichever way. So first, uh, first function, this pulley here, this uh, raises the boom by a multitude of block and tackle type pulleys here. And as I said, you can go proportionally, you can go slow, you can instantly reverse direction without having to flick here. So this, although it engages, having two directions in the gears becomes obsolete if you convert to control plus at control. And yeah, fast and slow. Next pulley function, the front pulley here, that raises and lowers the the hooking, the grappling claw, I guess you would call that. So yeah, you can go up and back just like that. Let's test it out on a real object. All right, so this is hand operated. You just turn this knob and then you can pick up some object. So it has plenty of lifting power. So the next, uh, function we get from the lever by moving it inwards towards the middle you can engage the rotation of the turntable and so we can take our load you can nicely control it get some nice trim left to right until you get it exactly where you want it Then we can go and switch over 
Oh, I bumped it. It was right. Okay, so. Then down we go. And we can release, release the Kraken. There we go. Okay, last function to show you guys is Ah, oh, yes, it can crawl around itself. So it's pretty remarkable how the gearing, the motor, one motor can perform four different functions by using a gearbox here, selecting either way, and then routing that power down to the underneath where it will drive the, the wheels. Next up is to show you guys how I managed to convert it to using the Control Plus hub. So here's how you set it up with the Control Plus motor instead of the Power Functions motor. So if we take a close look inside here, you'll see the Control Plus motor is fitted in there and there's a lift arm a nine length lift lift arm like this inside here and there should be one inside this side as well but the motor is one length longer so the easy fix is to have this sitting on top and clipped into the motor and then it comes up to the top here so you can still have the lift arm coming up to where it should be, but it's only a five length, not a nine length. Now here's the Control Plus hub. So just like the powered functions power box, you have these pins that hold it in place. And uh, it, the power functions control box simply slides down. I've done the same thing here by putting this bracket, just made up this bracket like this, very simple. Clip it on, and that will slide down into this location here. And I, I did it upside down to keep the, the cord out of the way. It's a little bit long, so I did it that way. Simply slides in and then the pins go in there to hold it in place. Easy as that. Well, that's it for the review of the 42042 crawler crane. If you guys think this is such a sensational machine that, that I do, then give it a thumbs up and uh, hit the subscribe button. You'll see a lot more videos like this. Isn't that a beauty? We'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.